Alexander Skarsgård had no idea who Miley Cyrus was. What? This headline is kind of true, you guys. And while it's not that important, it's kind of funny and cute. And well, I know you all like him and her, so I thought I'd give you the details on this. A new report claims that Miley spotted Alexander inside a coffee shop in LA and waltzed right on over to him to say hello. She allegedly raved about how much she loved this past season of True Blood and then gave him a big ol' smile and headed towards the exit. A source who was there to witness this cute encounter revealed that, quote, Alex just nodded politely as she walked away until one pal blurted, dude, you don't know who that was? That was Miley Cyrus. Skarsgård then seemed a little worried that he may have offended Miley by not knowing who she was, so he ran over to catch her before she left, and he said, quote, it was good to see you, Miley. Please have a great day. Miley apparently smiled, giving off the vibe that she knew he had forgotten who she was, but she had a totally nice attitude about it. In fact, get this, she said to him, it's all right if you don't remember who I am. And then she reminded him that she had partied with him at Beecher's Madhouse on three different occasions. And Miley was telling the truth. Both stars were there most recently together on June 26th. Yep. Funny stuff. Now, A. Scars is not the only celeb who had no idea who Miley was. At last year's iHeartRadio concert, Flava Flav actually thought Miley was Gwen Stefani, and he even called her Gwen to her face several times backstage. If you missed that awkward moment, I have the clip. Take a look. Gwen Stefani! <laughs> you still never got me a clock. Don't worry, I'll get you one. Also, kind of funny. Let's have some fun in the comment section. Which celebs do you think look alike and could easily be mistaken for one another? Perhaps Katy Perry and Zoe Deschanel. What about Teresa Palmer and Kristen Stewart? Maybe Nina Dobrev and Victoria Justice? Let me know which celebs look like twins to you. You can also tweet me, Facebook me, Instagram me, but get creative, have fun. Also, like and fave this video and subscribe for more videos all day, every day. In Hollywood, I'm your host, Katie Kraus. Thanks for watching and bye for now. You guys, Miley Cyrus wants to grow her hair back out and we covered that story yesterday and I wanna give you guys some shout outs. So Melissa Riley, one, four, three, she said, I really don't care, I love Miley, but it's her life and whatever she wants to do, she can do it. So there's no reason to rattle on and argue because she probably really doesn't care what people think. Smiler now and forever, I agree. Ann Mixon said, I liked her hair when it was right above her shoulders. That to me fit her the most, okay. And then Stella Park said, I think she should just let her hair grow. She could rock out her short hair and after a long time, she'll get her long hair back. By the way, I love Clever News, especially the reporter hashtag Cleverettes and just wanted to say, I especially love you too. How about that? All right, you guys, don't forget, comment, subscribe, thumbs up. See you later. Bye.